<clears throat> the thing that stopped me from being a great drummer, Neil, was time. I didn't have the time, and I didn't have the God-given gift. <laughs> That's a big one. <laughs> I had to end on the big one. I did not have the gift, and I, I, used to, I thought if I just kept working, working, working at it, I would somehow work my way into having the gift. Do you see and, yourself, wait, can I just ask you, do you see yourself in your 70s? Like doing comedy in Vegas somewhere and kind of doing like a Don Rickles type of situation, but then maybe you get behind the drums and sort of do like a musical comedy thing. Oh, God. It's like, <laughs> oh, God. But it's charming because you're old. <laughs> you know, that, would be, that would be so pathetic. No. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Yeah, but it be no, but it would be all the music I listen to. Welcome to the jungle. <laughs> and you're wearing like no, a and then, tuxedo. No, and then I'd have all the young hotties singing, going right. Bill's got fun and games, and then they come over, <laughs> then they come over, and they'd fucking pat my bald head. <laughs> oh, he's so adorable. Um, Nia, I would kill myself. I would, I would jump off the Welcome to Vegas sign. I'm saying that now as a 48-year-old. Who knows? Yeah, like, but don't you see, like, yeah, it, moving into your 70s, 80s, doing, like, a month or so residency. We can move to Vegas for a couple months. Nia, this is, like, live, the live, saddest live, scenario live ever. In, why? They would pay you a good amount of money. Why is that sad? You think you're going to be going on tour in your 70s? You think you're going to be on the road like you are now? No, I think I'm going to save my fucking money so I don't have to. The only reason I'll be on the fucking road in my 70s is if, if I w still want to be. If I still felt like I had something to say. But, but you're I'm going to be in my fucking 80s like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> What's up with... <laughs> I don't know. What's up with these computers? I'll still be bitching about the same shit. But you're going to... I know you. You're going to still want to do comedy. But I love not, making people laugh, and yeah. if I do it on a much smaller scale, I'm fine with that. But exactly. I'm not going to make a fucking ass of myself and have some <laughs> luau-themed fucking comedy show. Oh, please tell me you'll drag me off stage before I do that. <laughs> the day I show up and I'm in drag and I have, like, the, the coconuts over my fake titties. Caesar's you know, Palace presents <laughs> Bill Burr. <laughs> Oh god, that would be a nightmare. No, we could live in this. We could live in a suite at Caesars for like two months, and you do your, you know, classic comedy, <laughs> telling jokes from the two thousand twenty. Uh, well, that's the thing. You can't do classic comedy. You can't go out like I saw Don Rickles and Tony Orlando opened up. And he was playing, uh, you know, knock three times on the ceiling. And I, went, ah, I remember that fucking year. You're like psyched. Mm -hmm. You're psyched, but like no one's psyched to hear a joke again that they already heard. Mm. They just go away. I can't be like, all right. I don't know if you remember this, <laughs> but there was a president a long time ago. He stuck a cigar in the car. Monica Lewinsky. Monica Lewinsky. <laughs> they remember. <laughs> And then you just start doing all that, and then um, then I do like a medley of mm -hmm. styles that all influenced me. <laughs> <laughs> I do the Eddie Murphy laugh, the Sam Kinison yell, the Seinfeld why, <laughs> you know, as the band plays underneath it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, comedy and music have a lot of similarities. <laughs> There's a rhythm, isn't there, Johnny? <laughs> <laughs> And I'm wearing Hawaiian shirts because I'm crazy. What's what's he going to say next? Yeah, but you're not going to want to just rest on your laurels, even in your 70s. You're going to still want to go out. So I'm just thinking about... I'm going to rest on my ass. That's white like the mozzarella. Like the mozzarella. Like the mozzarella. <laughs> um, no, I... I, I I don't get the concept of retiring. Like, if you retire, you're just, then you're just, I would feel useless, and right. I would just be like, I'm going to die in about 10 days. I'm, I, I would be one of those people. If I retired, I would be dead in a week, because I'd just be like, it's over. I'm useless. Why am I still here? And I would yeah. go into an unbelievable depression. That's what I mean. So you and still I have to die. work, and, but you have to work in a capacity in which someone wants to see a 70-year-old comedian. <laughs> <laughs> 
And the place where people would want to see and pay to see a 70 year old comedian is Las Vegas. Let's be real. Or you could have like, you know, a, a few nights run at a, a, a theater in New York, maybe. But it's not like you're going to be going to all the comedy clubs like you're doing now, which is fine. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. All of that is really frightening. I can oh, tell I you that. Mean, I don't mean to frighten you. Uh, well, with the end, that's the end of your fucking life. It's just the end. Um, I'll be there with you. Don't worry. Yeah, no, I, I picture my 70s and 80s. Uh, I definitely am wearing slippers and I'm, <laughs> and I'm just <laughs> putzing around the house. Yeah. Yeah, God willing, you know, the house is paid for. I still have a nice car. Mm-hmm. Right? Definitely. The lucky thing that I have being a comedian is people always want to laugh. And I think that that's the reason why not only has it survived all of these new technologies, it actually thrives because, you know, what, I mean, what's, what's the main shit that you watch on the, on the Internet? You want to fucking laugh, laugh yeah. or jerk off to something. That's the two big <laughs> things. And yeah. um, comedy just it fits. You know, joke can be really quick. Guy walks into a bar. He says, blah, blah, blah. The guy says, blah, blah, blah. And done. You mm-hmm. get the fucking laugh. And these kids with their, their, their fucking squirrel-like attention spans, mm-hmm. it works. So um, I don't know how long it'll, or how long it works at this fucking level. Uh, but uh, I don't know. Yeah, all that shit's fucking scary to me. <laughs> 